Hello, Power Raiders. I am Power Nate. And I'm the Mountain. And today we will be reviewing the uh, Power Aid Zero Citrus Peach. Um, I got the name right. Yes, Citrus Peach. Yes, yes. This is actually the bottle that I received in the Coca Cola Insiders Club. Ooh. Fun fact. I kept it. You can get this in stores. Actually, I have the little thing here. Uh, insider, welcome to the club. I don't know if we can see that. Yeah, it's... move this a little. But there you go. Says it there. I did get a retro can of Coke and a Dunkin' Girl Scouts iced coffee. I got coconut caramel, but there's other flavors. And I got this flavor, the citrus peach. Mm -hmm. And the other one we tried was the mountain, the melon berry, mm. which I did not get because you only get one. But it's quite good. And also it has a thing on the back. And word search. Yeah, I haven't yet completed. No, I, I don't really want to fill it in. I mean, I might just like print it and then I'll solve it. Mm. Oh, actually, it says there's Powerade is one of the words on here. Really? I want to see if I can find it. I wonder it. if you can find Powerade. Um, I'm assuming... It's, the, it's next to an ER. Is it, are there diagonals? That'd be cool if there were. No, there are diagonals. Mm -hmm. um, I see Duncan. The bottom. I'm feeling... Uh, I see Coco. Oh, I found Powerade! Where? Uh, if you have here... Oh, it's 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 backwards yeah, and Yeah, it's diagonal? backwards and diagonal. Hold oh, that's on. Hard. I want to see if I can... Um... If, if so you do it, I'll, go... I'll show it out in the, in the edit. Yeah, so it's this P, and you go up. Oh, there you and, go. Yeah. It might actually be reversed on the thing. Well, no, it'll show up right, I think, once we're done. It's just oh, showing up reversed now. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. Um, no, it won't. What? Oh, no, you're right. You're on the left. I always forget. Yeah. Yeah, because in the edit, it's different, and I don't think about <laughs> that. You don't like viewing, like, the... Like me on the the left. No, because that's that, I mean, that's how it comes out. But I just don't think about it because when I look at the video, it's always a me on the on the left. I mm -hmm. get confused. But otherwise, you wouldn't be able to read the words Powerade. So yeah, it'd be very but, confusing. But anyway, yeah, I'll take this back. I believe that. that's. Weird. I do also have the other one. Uh, it doesn't have anything as cool on it. Can't it's just how do I show this off? Cover that up. Yeah, there you go. And it doesn't have anything on it exciting. There's always, like, weird little things. This month you're invited to enjoy a virtual event with the 2019 FIFA's Women World Cup champion, Kelly O'Hara. Which I did not do, unfortunately. Mm. I think that's done. And then there's a... There's just a maze. But... Yeah, I'm too lazy to solve the maze right now. No, I don't, I don't want to uh, solve I'm it. I'm glad I found so power. I solve it. Um, yeah, these are more... That's just it. I, I didn't bring the boxes or anything this time because there's no point. Yeah. They look the same. But, um... Yeah, just kind of getting on to this yeah, bottle itself. Me. Um, so it has a nice little... You know, sort of, I guess, orangey red yeah. color. Nice. Yeah, it's like a, I don't want to say salmon. It's it's like a peach color, kind of. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it is literally. It's a light orange. The, the color you would describe as peach. Yeah. Um. So, uh, oh, there? one thing we have to mention yes. is that if you look on the top, this is a new cap. It says. I, I don't know if that'll show. You have to maybe angle it differently. Hold on. Let's... It says power. Oh, there you go. Kind there we go. That's how. power through. It does say power through on the top. As opposed to just power read. Which, which is, is a new line, sort of, I guess it might, this might be a new slogan for Coca-Cola uh, concerning the Powerade brand. I think actually it's a slightly older slogan, but yes. Oh. I, I think they used it before, yeah. Is that kind of why it has like a retro sort of, you know, look to it? I don't know if it's a retro look. I think that's just the sort of look they use for Powerade. Okay. It's very blocky word font. Yeah, you, yeah, uh, yeah. What do you know? I don't know anything. But anyway, getting to the ingredients section. Oh, yes, of course. We have water, less than 1% of citric acid, electrolytes such as salt, magnesium and calcium chloride, and monopotassium phosphate, natural colors, sucralose, Acesulfan K, uh, vitamins B3, B6, and B12, uh, getting to the hard to pronounce section, niacinamide, pyridoxine, hydrochloride, uh, cyanocolobulamin, uh, yellow 4, red 40, ascorbic acid to protect taste, 
uh, as well as calcium disodium EDTA to protect color. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. But yeah, this seems to be a very, very, um... I mean, just the name, right? I mean, just citrus peach. Like, that That sounds good. Do we think it's going to be more peach or more citrus? Probably more peach, right? I feel like peach is a strong flavor. Mm -hmm. I feel like citrus, it's going to just be like maybe a hint of like lemon or something. My theory orange. is that it's going to it's gonna be very peachy, but it's going to kind of have like almost a peach ring taste. Mm, I could see that. Almost like peach, but it also has like this lingering sourness to it. I could see that. Is there there's citric acid, right? Yeah. I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like I mean there should be some sour a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. We hope so. You'd hope. I mean usually with I mean it's a zero, so there's gonna be some sort of bitter sharpness aspect. We can mm -hmm. already sort of predict. Um, but we don't actually know until we crack it open. I s and I that's a great segue into actually cracking it open. It's almost like I knew what we were doing. It's almost like these have the Ooh, same format. That actually didn't really have a crack to it. Weird. Ooh, that is. Is it a good smell? It is. Fra oh, is it a spilled. good build? It's fragrant. Oh my gosh, that's like um, that has a different smell. I don't know what you describe. That's that's not peach ring. That's like a different thing. Yeah, it does smell familiar though. I don't know what that is. I'll have to smell it more. Like maybe like like a nectarine or something. Maybe. I don't know. Nectarine would actually fit. I think. It's not peach ring peach. It's some kind of, it's like a more sour peach. Like, maybe like a, um, like from like a peach bellini or something. Mm. I think that maybe that's where I'm getting that sort of peach smell from. Hmm. Like, it's like peach nectar maybe is the is the better way. It to definitely it. smells familiar. Whatever I'm smelling, I have smelled it before. I think it's peach nectar is what I'm getting mm. the smell of. Which is good because that means it's more of like a natural peach maybe. Oh. Because artificial peach is what we get in like a peach ring. Mm. So maybe it is a different, a different smell, so... It's hard to say. But yeah. It's quite nice. The color is quite nice. It is rather orange, mm -hmm. I will say. It's like slightly pinker, but it, it's still orange. It's just not as orange yellowy as the orange. Yeah. Yeah. But but uh I think it's time to This is quite I'm looking excited. forward to this. I'm very looking forward to this. That's I bad think grammar. It's time. Yeah, cheers. 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 That's pretty good. Goodness gracious, that's, that's very good. good. That's very good. That's weirdly good. I would go, like, it's funny. We talked about the the um, the um typical zero flavor, and there's none of that. There's a little bit of that. It, it, it's coming to me a little bit at the very end, but, like, yeah. it's very smooth. It is super smooth, and it tastes good, too. It has a really good taste. Like, it's, I don't know, I think that might be lemon or something. I don't, I get mostly peach, right? Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. it, it's almost primarily peach. Like, I didn't really get anything strong citrus. There's just, like, a, there's citric acid, some, like, a bit of sourness in there, and, like, tartness from the peach, but I wouldn't say there's, like, any specific citrus flavor that I taste. Yeah. Gotta pour some more. Yeah, no, I mean, very it's, enjoyable. It's, it's just a very tart peach. Which I guess is what they're going for for their very summery sort mm -hmm. of flavors. That's actually that's really good, honestly. I enjoy it. I did it. not expect that to be as tasty as it was. I I um I don't want to start anything too early here, but I think this may be the best zero. It's funny. I was thinking the exact same thing. Like, Out of like maybe maybe mountain berries is up there. Grape we actually both enjoyed because it was actually different to normal grape. Mm -hmm. I remember that. Those are the two that sort of stand out to me. Um, I think we gave Mountain Berry a 6.5, but... And I must say, well, I guess we keep talking about the, the positives. I must say one thing I've noticed is that there is kind of almost a weird throat feel. Yeah, there's it. a bit of a throat feel. 
Um, it's like it's it's not as strong as it was with the watermelon though. Yeah, I mean, here's it's, it's like kind of like I can feel it in the back of my throat, like kind of mm -hmm. just. But it's yeah. not in the mouth, really. I think. Yeah, it's more so good. in the throat, which is it's a little bit of a of a good thing. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's very good, very smooth. Yeah, very enjoyable overall. It, this makes me um I wanted to bring this up in the other video, but I'm gonna I'm gonna sort of segue into it here. Mm -hmm. What other combinations of drinks do you think Powerade could do? Like come, like so we have this. So this is supposed to be citrus peach. We have watermelon berry. What other like combo like punch sort of flavors do you think they could do? That'd hmm. be good. I'd like to see them. Uh, well, actually, no. I was gonna say blackberry. They already have one. They right? had blackberry. I don't know if they're making it anymore. Ooh, I think like a blackberry. Would... They have black currant in in other countries, which may be easier to get than black black uh, than blackberry. But that's different. I think obviously. I think that a, a blackberry one would be pretty nice. Like if yeah. they have like some it's very tart. Yeah, like they could make some. Uh, What's the closest? Like... Have we had a raspberry? I think we no. I don't think so. What if they have like a? How about Excuse this? Me. How about this? They have a blackberry f flavor. So like they have a flavor that's like a blackberry mm -hmm. mixed with a raspberry, and they can okay. call it like black raspberry. That'd be pretty good. Like powery black raspberry. That'd be very tasty. I think that'd be good, and it's like kind of almost like a, a a really dark blue. Oh, ooh, that could be good. Or maybe even a like really a dark blue? red. I, I thought it would be more of a dark red, because yeah. cause raspberry and, and I don't know, I mean, is kind of... To be honest, my mind originally went to, like, a, a blue raspberry type deal, but I think okay. it might work better with a... Oh, yeah, I guess we did actually have blue... We had um, blue raspberry cherry, didn't we? Mm, That's, yes. I guess technically we have had a raspberry. I wanted to see, like... Because before you were mentioning cinnamon, and that made me think of, like, sort of non-standard things. The only one that we've really seen as of now has been cucumber. What if they had, like, a mint lime, like a sort of mojito? Ooh. That could be pretty good. I feel like mint is rather unexplored in soft drinks and sports mm. drinks. That's interesting. Because it gives you a kind of cooling effect, which I feel like would be really good if you're trying to stay hydrated. Mm -hmm. If you're trying to, you know, get in the game, I mean, if you're playing, like, I don't know, beach volleyball or whatever, you want to get your sets and, and bumps and things in, you want to you wanna get cool off. And I feel like mint would be pretty good. Just like a hint. like Not, mm -hmm. like, not like a mint-flavored beverage. I do like mint, but... I recognize that probably isn't the best for a sports drink, but I feel like mint would be pretty good. Yeah. Like, I'm, you mentioned cinnamon or, or like a spiced wine or one of these sort of flavors, but I feel like a I feel like that sort of flavor does not lend itself as well to mm -hmm. to a sports drink. I feel like that kind of roughs your throat up a little bit. Maybe. And like for a sports Maybe drink. Maybe another like, um, hmm. Yeah. What if they had... Oh, this would be interesting. Maybe like a sort of vanilla. Ooh, that, I think vanilla could work in a really weird way, but it would work still. It reminds me, um, almost. I feel like like that vanilla. It would have um. It reminds me of those, and we're not sponsored, by the way. Those like Baj drinks, Bai, whatever mm. it is, B A J. Um, I've never had one of those, but I've. I've they're definitely not very good. Them. They have this um weird coffee fruit extract, which has a very weird bitterness which i don't quite enjoy um and i feel like it kind of ruins the beverage quite a bit um so i don't drink them uh but they do exist and they have like sort of strange flavors like they may have like coconut or like maybe like a dragon fruit or something like that or or one of those sort of a bit more obscure fruits and actually something obscure might be good like mm. a, like a pina colada for a Powerade? Yeah, pina colada Powerade seems like it would What be... about a, a, like a starfruit Powerade? Starfruit has very little flavor. Have you had a starfruit? I haven't, but it looks like it would have nice flavor. It has actually almost no flavor. It's mostly because it has weird texture. The outside is like a sort of weird rubbery sort of texture. And the inside is just kind of like a, a sort of a... Just like a general nothing. Just wet. Hmm. I don't know how I would describe... I guess like maybe a kiwi sort of? Hold on. We have a low battery warning on yeah, my phone. But, but uh, yeah. Yeah, but it, yeah. so weird flavors. They should do some... Guava would be good. Pineapple, papaya. Guava. Guava would be good. Guava, guava would, be, would good. be really good. I wish they would bring back normal mango that's not in the power water. I do like the power water, and it's rather sweet, but I do want the normal, mm. the normal sugar one. That's hard to find, if it even exists anymore. But... 
No, just just to kind of you know just briefly reorient ourselves. Yes, of course. Back into this select Powerade. Who would you rank this out of a seven? Oh, this is tough. I I want to give it. I want to give it that high rank, but I. I don't know. I was going to give it a high rank. I was going to give it a... I, I'm not going to give it the highest rank. I feel like that'd be a little silly. Because it does have a little bit of that sharpness to it still. I might surprise you with my ranking. A 6.5? Yes. I was also going to say a 6.5. Okay, so. so we're once again on the same page. I'm glad to see it. Because it, it doesn't is, happen all the time. Or often. Or ever. It is, very, it is a very nice flavor. It is... Amazing for the zeros. I, this is definitely one of the best zeros we've had. Oh yeah, absolutely. On the show, this, this may be I think tied with Mountain Berry then for the mm -hmm. best. Because mm -hmm. that's just good. They should just make this a sugared flavor. Yeah, if they made this a sugared flavor or a normal flavor, and I guess it's not technically sugared because it's corn syrup, but whatever. Yeah, but but it's good. So yeah, still still gets the job it's done. It's so tasty. Yes, this is gonna be. This is I see now, but I'm slightly worried that this is like part of the summer lineup because perhaps it doesn't last forever and that would make me sad because mm -hmm. this is very good and i want this to be a common thing are you suggesting that we stock up on the citrus peach i think i, I wouldn't say stock up on citrus peach but we well because technically actually nothing they've released since the ultras has gone away right no hmm. i don't think so unless they got rid of one of the ultras which i don't think they did oh yeah. they did didn't they which one? It, uh either white cherry or citrus huh Hopefully citrus. That wasn't very good. No, it wasn't. I think one of the flavors may have gotten discontinued, mm. or they just didn't update the design on the page, and I didn't notice. But, I mean, the, the ultras aren't that good, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. You're not um, missing much if you yeah. miss one of those ultras. These are, but, but the zeros, some of them are good. And yeah. Like this one. This this is absolutely... This one, case in point, yeah. can be a good zero. If you don't normally drink the zeros... I would seriously recommend give it. We got oh, it. Hold on. Oh, no, there we go. It. Back giving, to normal. Giving this a try because it's delicious. I'm not going to do a second take. We're leaving that in. It's crazy. Yeah. Um, I don't want to edit. I apologize for that. Uh, you could see the fan that's above us. It's fine. I'll, I'll blur it out or something. <laughs> No personal information. No personal fan inf <laughs> fan brand information. I don't think we got the... I, I think we might need to get a release form for that, that yeah. fan. The only fans you need to see are us. Powerade fans. Yes. I have the shirt. I have the ho hoodie and everything. It's great. I love Powerade. I unfortunately do not have oh. a Powerade hoodie. I do have a hoodie on, though. It's a, I, it's I a short sleeve hoodie. Did I tell you? They, they have official Powerade uh, hoodies. Really? Jerseys, yeah. So you can put a number on it we might have to get one of those you can there i i didn't check every number there was there was one funny number that they did not allow you to get on the on the on the jersey i think I'm, i think we all know what it's, funny a, two, number. it's a two digit number that they, they look kind of like similar but they're like opposites mm. it's and they ha, they kind of have like a like a circle on them there's like two circles and there's like lines and stuff but you can't put that on their jersey and you said it's only two two digit numbers I think you can do one digit numbers, okay. and I think there's a name as well. And I think, but I think they're just like white text on a black jersey or something, or hoodie or whatever. Does it have like the Powerade logo? I I I don't know if it has the Powerade logo. I think it has something to do with Powerade, but I don't remember what mm. it is. I will have to do more research into this because I'm very intrigued by this. Topic. It's an official. This is obviously this is not official merchandise. Of as much as I like it, but you know, it is what it is. It didn't exist when I got this hoodie, mm. so. Now that they do exist. Might the, have to invest. Yeah. The, there is like a Coke merch store, but a lot of it's like not very good. I actually, it was funny. One of the things they had in there was the paper straws that I got for free in one of the insider boxes. And I was hmm. like, I haven't used any of mine, so I am not going to buy any new ones. <laughs> they, but I, I guess they exist because nobody bought them or something. I, I assume either they made too many and put them in the box or nobody wanted them and they put them in the box. Or put them on the store, or vice versa. Hmm. But you can get the Coca-Cola paper straws. That's interesting. But yeah, I... I Forgive I, me for the tangent. No, that's fine, friend. Um, yeah, I'm very interested in the, you know, this official Powerade merch. I'm, you know, we might have to... I don't know if we necessarily have to do a whole separate video on it. We could do a separate video, that'd be good. Yeah, just a little discussion of the... Yeah. I, I think know. it'd be very tasty. Yeah. Tasty shirt. Very tasty. But, yeah. 
I'm, you know, just Powerade, official Powerade merch has been lacking. And I'm glad that we're finally seeing some, you know, actual. Yeah, I mean, besides this, what has it been? It's like, I think you can maybe get a, like a big, like a five gallon thing, maybe. You can get like a little carrying case. You can get some bottles um, and cups. And I think that's about it. Yeah. There's not a ton. And enough, obviously it's meant for like actual athletes mm -hmm. like as you can tell i'm not an athlete but i'm not an athlete either no i just like to we just this. like powerade yeah which is weird because the branding i don't know if you like pay attention to the powerade branding it is very heavily athlete focused it mm -hmm. is not meant for nerds it is not meant for casual consumption no it's not meant i mean like we're just sitting on a couch drinking this yeah like it's cool because we put it in the fridge but it's not like ideal mm -hmm. but it's good so who cares yeah. i like powerade I'd like Powerade, too. I'm a pro Powerade fan. And especially this one, which is mm -hmm. very good. Please very good. Drink it. Do you have any uh, just concluding thoughts on this drink? Uh, it should be pinker. Mm. That's my that's my take. I agree. Well. I agree. I think it's too orange. I think. Yeah, like even the text is like pretty orange. I think it could be a bit more pink. I think that would, you know, like I, it, I do it, like. I even would more, like... even just salmon. Yeah. Like that'd be good. I like I, I like the idea of a very pink Powerade, like a hot pink Powerade. Ooh, that'd be that would be that'd be bold because mm -hmm. the pink ones they have are only like the strawberry lemonade and stuff. Yeah, and that's kind of like a muted sort of desaturated pink. I want a hot pink would be interesting. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that looks like. We'll have to figure that out someday yeah. if that if that exists. A magenta Powerade. Mm -hmm. But to uh, just to give my quick th closing thoughts on this Powerade, um, it's really good. Yeah. It's surprisingly good especially for a zero um i would highly recommend trying it out uh especially if you're you know maybe not so keen on the zero lines you think maybe oh there nothing can good come out can come out of the zero lines well I, this is very much the you know antithesis oh i i think i pronounced that right yeah antithesis yeah i pronounced that right. not antithesis yeah it looks like that but it's not pronounced yeah. like that no. but this is you know this is the antithesis to all the other power aids of Powerade Zeros, of course, you know, in that, you know, it doesn't really have too much of that bitter taste that comes as, you know, typical of the Powerade it's Zeros. It's tartness, but it's good. Mm -hmm. And overall, just a very strong drink from the Coca-Cola Company. Thank you. Yes. And on that note, thank you for watching. Uh, and be sure to stay safe. And chill.